So this is an Arduino Uno. The Arduino Uno is an open source microcontroller board based on microchip at Mega328P. So what happens when we connect Arduino Uno to laptop? Let's consider on Arduino Uno and laptop. First you need to install Arduino IDE on your laptop. Here's what Arduino IDE looks like on your laptop. Connecting through USB Type-B cable. Let's have a closer look what happens when we connect USB cable to the laptop. The side pins are shown are the power lines and the another one in the middle are called data lines. So when we connect USB cable the power supply part connects first and after that data lines are connected to the laptop that transfers data to the laptop. What happens on the side of Arduino? So let's power it up. Okay, let's have a closer look what Atmega 16U2 do. So this is an Atmega 16U2 chip. The lines shown in blue are called data lines. So Atmega 16U2 acts as an interface between laptop and Arduino Uno. It gives data that is hex file that tells the laptop the function of Arduino Uno and makes a COM port for Arduino. Arduino Uno can work as a mouse keyboard and just need the hex file to be uploaded in the Atmega 16U2 so that it gives the function to laptop as a mouse or a keyboard. This hex file is called the firmware of Arduino Uno. I hope you like this video so give us a thumbs up and share this with your friends. And don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thanks for watching.